So now we explore the methodologies. You've established, hopefully, your ontology, your epistemology, and your theoretical framework. And these inform the approach you take to conducting research, which we call your methodology. And within that methodology, you would then employ a range of methods, which are the actual techniques you've, you use to conduct your research, such as a survey or a questionnaire or an experiment. So there are three main types of methodologies. There's quantitative, qualitative, and mixed methods. Now, quantitative methods and methodology is generally what we call deductive. Um, we tend to use an experimental approach or quasi-experimental approach. Um, sometimes we can also use the survey method. Um, but essentially, you frame a research question and then you try to, um, or that informs the approach you take to explore that research question, generally as an experiment or collection of data, and you then try to prove or disprove certain research questions, which we call hypotheses. Now, qualitative research takes a very different approach. It essentially is an inductive approach to research, where we don't start with a research question per se, we start with an area of investigation and through the gathering of data and through an exploration of that research question, we um, inductively develop an understanding of an answer to a research question. So the research question can sometimes emerge from the research process. That is very much an opposite approach to deductive experimental research. Um, quantitative research. So in addition to that we have a type of research called mixed methods. This is where we use, can use a combination of research methods and methodologies. Now most commonly this is combining quantitative and qualitative research methods um, but it doesn't have to. Sometimes it can also be combining um, within the, those other two methods or methodologies. So mixed methods, while it's, many researchers do um, see it as an easier approach where you can um, collect, say, survey data in a quantitative way and also conduct interviews in a qualitative way. That's probably the most common mixed method approach in educational research. Technically, what you should be doing is explaining how you are combining those two methods. Um, a quantitative method of survey collection and a qualitative method of conducting interviews and how they can be combined together validly as a methodology um, and how that would then be more beneficial than simply doing a quantitative survey um, quasi-experimental approach or a qualitative interview ethnographic investigation. Um, so it's generally mixed methods should involve more work, but they are commonly used with the misnomer that um, because a study may be using some, some data, some numerical data, then it's a quantitative study, um, even though it may predominantly be a qualitative study. So we'll explore that more as we go through our investigation of methodologies.